had my accident June 18th of 2020. It was three days after my 29th birthday. I was in a coma for at least six to seven weeks. I woke up in the hospital, didn't know what had happened. I was so confused, I couldn't speak. Up to 50% of people uh, that sustain this injury don't even make it to the hospital. Her um, injury severity score was off the charts, so pretty high mortality risk when she hit the door. Internal decapitation is kind of a generic term for it. There's basically skin and muscle holding the head to the spine, and so that's basically her situation. And then we knew we had to stabilize her uh, cranial cervical junction. She would need what we call an occipital cervical fusion where we reconnect the spine to the head and, and use bone grafts and, and instrumentation to, to reconnect and, and grow, grow uh, fusion together. Like I have metal plate, metal plate, spine, and had internal surgeries. My, my, both my legs was broken. So I should have given up, but I didn't. I'm glad I didn't. Once she was out of the hospital, she went to rehabilitation for a while, and you know she wasn't walking for a long time because she couldn't bear weight on the extremities because her legs were broken. So you know that alone took six or eight months, and you know about a year she was able to walk into the office. Um, so she had made some good recovery at one year, and then obviously here now at little over two years, um, we're seeing her re-engage into normal life as a citizen. It's a litany of people from ICU, critical care, intensivists, trauma surgeons, nursing. This a whole team to get someone to, to you know, have a, such a great outcome. I kept pushing myself. I kept pushing myself. I feel like I'm better than before. Like, my mindset is so different. I, I know that I'm blessed. Like, I'm here for a reason. Like, I'm blessed for the doctors I had that put me back together. Because that's what I tell people. My doctors had to put me back together because they did have to put me back together from head to toe. I walk around smiling because I'm here for a reason.